Tom, where's Angela? You broke the law of the monsters. She's punished. She's feeling not really good now. <laughs> How dare you to take her away? Where did you bring her? She paid for everything you've done. You will never see her again. Your turn is coming soon. You're a monster. You're just a monster. Bring her back to me. It's not her fault. Fine, fine. I'll tell you the place where you can find her. Come on, tell me. Look in the yard. She's there. Relaxing. <laughs> in the yard? I've just been there. She wasn't there. I told you, go and look in the yard. Don't fight me. Why should I believe you? You always lie to me. Because you have no choice, silly girl. I command here who, where and when, understand? Okay, I'll go and check. I'm not gonna talk into you here, you're evil. <laughs> oh my god, Angela is dead! If you click like and subscribe my channel in 3 seconds, Talking Tom with his squad won't come for you tonight. Count down. 3, 2, 1, 0. Thank you so much if you did it. Well, let's go. It's 3 a.m. Of course, we are entering the game. Oh my god, what's going on here? They all are incredibly hungry. Are you hungry? Food. Give us some food. Mmm, actually, I don't know. Should I feed you? Snacks, snacks, snacks. Hey, what's going on? Where's my food? Not only you can mock me. I want it too. Give us some food. Mmm, I'm out of my money. I can't buy you food. <laughs> Give us some food, Xuxa, right now. Fine, fine, let's go. Stop shouting at me and scaring me. I got you. Well, okay, let's start one by one. Angela, come on. Oh, stop burping, guys. I don't really want to feed you after it. Okay, goodbye, I fed you. Okay, now the next guys. Take your seats. Oh, I'm so happy you just want to eat, but not these. But not these different needs I have to meet game by game. Hanky, hello, we're still there, hi. Are you full, guys? I'd like to have some meat. Mmm, I don't think so. Well, fine. Have you noticed that Ginger is always hungry? I'm seriously, guys, he's the most hungry monster in this game. It don't matter how many snacks I give him, he's still hungry. Well, okay, let's go back to feed you. You're so glutton. This and this. Why did I take the pepper? Fine, eat your chocolate, it's so nutritious. I mean in this game. Okay, we're ready. Let's send the back to take a bath. Look, they're talking to each other. What are you talking about, guys? Let's try to listen them in. Hank, what is your favorite dish? Mm, I like meat with blood. I wish I could never heard it. Let's go to treat Angela. Your conversation is over, guys. We are on our way to the hospital. Angela, sweetie, what's wrong with you? Is it Tom? No, Ksush, I just walked under the rain. Okay, don't worry, I can help you. Hurry up, I feel so bad. Take this one, yes. Can you make a big blow? It's gonna be big boom. Come on. Da -da -da -dum. You've never seen that Angela before. <laughs> what is this? Is it a potion? It was a potion and we bought it. Angela, did you notice it? Take and keep it with you. I bought it so you can use it against Tom. Look, Ginger is listening, singing Hanky. Seems like Hanky's really good at it. Now I need to talk to Tom. Finally, it's the time. Last time he was so mad. Let's check what he says today. Tom? So what, little thieves? Can you sleep well? I mean, you and Angela. Don't be so evil. We just watched the video. It's not her fault. You broke all the monster's laws. And you tried to fool me. I won't let you go, little fees. You're absolutely evil. If you keep on acting like this, I won't talk to you anymore. <laughs> Such a pity. You can scare me, girl, but I will scare you. Okay, how can you scare me this time? You will see it later. I promise you, till the end of this game, your hair is turning white from fear. Fine, I'll be waiting for the end of this game. How can you scare me? I saw everything. I'm not afraid of you monsters anymore. Fine, we'll see today. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Tom. Okay, now I'll send all our squad to go to the treehouse to read a creepy story. 
they love these creepy stories, thereby I can get a bonus in the end. I'm curious what Tom can show me today, how he wants to scare me. As usual, they all want to sleep before going to the treehouse, but I'll wake them up. Yeah, I'll spend my money on it. Hank, I think you want to sleep too. So guys, let's get some sleep, get up, enjoy your lives, and let's go for our adventure, which is called a creepy story you've never heard. Okay, what else do you want, guys? Becca, where are you sneaking this way? Where are you sneaking? Look, look at her. Where are you going? Um, something is wrong with her. Let's watch her. Look, guys, look at her. She's sneaking somewhere. Are you gonna do your monster stuff? You think I can't see you? Well, I can. I can see you. Uh-huh. Yes, yes, we call you. You won't go anywhere. If you'll try again, we'll be watching you. So where's my favorite treehouse? I like to spend time with them there so much. So guys, are you ready to listen to a creepy story you've been waiting for? Yeah? I'll read it for you. It's just my only chance to scare monsters by myself. Reading creepy stories. A boy befriended a girl. One day they decided to take a walk around the city. Just two of them, without adults. It's autumn. All the roads were covered up with beautiful yellow and red leaves. A boy and a girl were walking. They were enjoying the smell of this foliage and listening to its rustling under their feet. So they went to the park. It was really good there. The air was so balmy that they thought they were drinking. Occasionally, they almost stumbled on some kind of rope stretched across the path, stepped over it and went on. Suddenly, their feet sank into something liquid. At first, the boy and girl thought they were in a swamp. They started pulling their legs out of this vicious place, but the more they tried, the deeper they fell. So they mired down to the waist. It turned out that it was liquid concrete. Walkers recently dug a hole there and filled it with concrete. To prevent anyone from falling through, they fenced this place with a rope. But the children didn't understand that this rope meant a warning. And also this yellow foliage treacherously covered the liquid concrete. The boy told the girl to climb onto his shoulders and try to jump to solid ground. And so they did. But the girl couldn't jump so far and dived headlong into the concrete. The boy panicked, took out his phone and started calling everyone. Parents, walkers and rescuers arrived soon, but they couldn't find this girl. After this happened, the boy couldn't go to school for a month. He got a severe nervous breakdown. Every night, the ghost of this concrete girl was coming to him, trying to calm him down that it wasn't his fault. One day, Concrete Girl said that she came for the last time because the concrete is freezing and it is getting harder for her to move. So this boy never saw her again. What a terrible story. It was so creepy. The last walk, everything started so pretty, so good, but I'm just shocked by this story. Write your feelings in comments. So guys, I need to talk to Angela right now about something really important. Where is she? I can't see her. Tom! Why are you laughing? Where's Angela? I can't find her. Where did you bring her? Tom! He pretends he can't hear me. What are you doing there? Answer me! I can't find my Angela. She's not outside. Not in the bathroom, not in the kitchen, not on the bed, not in the wardrobe. Where's Angela? She's not in this game. Tom, talk to me. Tom, where's Angela? You broke the law of the monsters. She's punished. She's feeling not really good now. <laughs> How dare you to take her away? Where did you bring her? She paid for everything you've done. You will never see her again. Your turn is coming soon. You're a monster. You're just a monster. Bring her back to me. It's not her fault. Fine, fine. I'll tell you the place where you can find her. Come on, tell me. Look in the yard. She's there, relaxing. <laughs> in the yard? I've just been there. She wasn't there. I told you, go and look in the yard. Don't fight me. Why should I believe you? You always lie to me. Because you have no choice, silly girl. I command here who, where and when, understand? 
Okay, I'll go and check. I'm not gonna talk into you here, you're evil. Oh my god! Angela is dead! Angela! Angela, wake up! What happened to you? Angela, who did this to you? Can you hear me, Angela? I can't shout till she's heard. She's just lying down there. Angela! Angela! Gosh, what happened to you? I need to find Tom. Let's talk to him. Tom! What did you do to her? I told you. She answered for everything she's done. <laughs> Did you kill Angela? <laughs> You're so funny. Where's Angela? Where's Angela? <laughs> She's fine. Wait, what do you mean? I'm seriously. You're lying to me again. I've just seen her dead. It was a fake. Just a toy. I taught you a lesson. Hope you won't try to fool me again. Why should I believe you? Go to our pool. You'll find her there. Safe and sound. At least for now. <laughs> yeah, I'll go there right now. Let's go and check his words. Angela! Angela, you're fine. Hi! We found her. She's okay. I'm so happy to see you. She is fine. Just a bit sleepy. Where were you? Where he was hiding you? I've been sitting to some cellar. It was dark there and very scary. It is so awful. Hope you'll be okay. Tom's just fooled me. He said you are dead. Oh my god. It's all my fault. I shouldn't have stolen that video. Let's go and get you to sleep. I'm happy you're fine. Sweet dreams, my sweetie. What an evil Tom. He fooled us today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Click like and subscribe my channel. I love you so much. Bye bye.